Hey guys, Steel Stark here with the three-part mini-series on the history of the Nintendo handheld line, from the Game & Watch series to the new 3DS XL. In this first part, I'm going to cover Game & Watch handhelds, as well as the Game Boy. Back before the original Game Boy blew up in the 90s, Nintendo released a handheld series called the Game & Watch Handhelds, which included ports of many of their arcade games, including Donkey Kong, as well as many original games such as Mario Cement Factory. The original Game Boy, released in the 90s, included many sequels to beloved games on the NES, such as Kid Icarus 2 and Metroid 2. The Game Boy had many original titles, such as the original two Pokemon games. Next came along the Game Boy Mini, which was just smaller than the Game Boy and played all of the same games. After the Game Boy Mini came the Game Boy Color, which just added color and had a bunch of games made specifically for it, which were also backwards compatible with the Game Boy. After the Game Boy Color came the Game Boy Advance, which had smaller cartridges and a better screen. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, and move on to the next video after this, because they're all coming out on the same day.